Okay. Where's Crom? Oh yeah, Cromdo's house is right here. Okay, he's getting out. Wait. I see another uh, snatcher. Oh no. What is he doing? He likes their boombox. Not awake, not asleep. Get up, everybody. Come on and do the wiggle with me. Do the wiggle. Do the wiggle with me. Man, is somebody there? You didn't hear anything, pal. You... I heard all of it. Get me a bunk snack. So delicious. <laughs> all right. Let's go, uh, that was pretty easy. Everyone loves, does the wiggle. Okay, did we find, no, I think it's somewhere else, right? Hmm. There's Befica. Befica! Gee, that explains why he's always so jealous of Wiggle. Why would he even hide that? It almost makes him kind of likable. Do you know where I could find this missing piece? Ouch. No. Hmm. Crack the code. Mm. Boiling bait. Well, I mean, here's one thing. So, by the beach, there's like a door, right? We haven't accessed before. Maybe it's there. Oh, this guy's out in the open? Never mind. Oh, who's that? Fluffy! Fluffy! No! Ah, Bowling Bay, we found it. The game has opened itself up. Boiling Bay. Golden Queeble. Anything else? Red Vanoper. La Sodi Lux. Oh, that should be. What the heck is that? Green Grapple. Perfect. Prefers to stay underwater, but prefers what will surface to pick up things that catches his eye. Okay. So let's go grab this. Uh... Oh, why are you going the other way? All right, well. So how should we trip this guy? Maybe... Was it too far? Oh, you know what? Maybe I can attach it on these things. If 
Peltas Glande. You took your precious time getting here. Any longer, and my leg might have rotted away. Come, let's finish our work. Absolutely not. I'm on the verge of a breakthrough. Now assist me or be gone with you. How can I assist? Ah, always a question worth asking. Preparations for my grand experiment are nearly complete. Soon we will see if we can amend my ambulation. But for now, simply transform my arm into a red banapa. <laughs> oh. Uh, that is all. Red banapa. What? Wait, what? What? Do I have that? I don't think I have that. Re oh, so a red one of the. Uh... Okay, where the where's that guy? Sherby, wait, is that what? It drills beneath the sand, waiting to unleash frosty vengeance on its foes. Oh, another one of these guys. Wait. Yo, that's the missing page, right? Other half of the cold. Looks like I need to weigh down the pressure plates in order. First, left, right, center. And after that, push down hard on all three. That should get a response. Hey, we got it. Now the question is... Where is this red banner? Green grapple, yes. Maybe it's in this way. Let's. Ooh. Maybe it's under here. Flaming chi poof. <laughs> Flaming Cheetos. Got it. Hot, 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 hot. Okay, what's this? New. Noodler, bathes in pools of lava, can't be put out while in such a hot climate. Hmm. This seems like another puzzle thing. Hmm. I don't know if I want to try it. <laughs> Let's see, there's more to this. Uh... Oh! Okay, we've got a pale toss we can probably use. That's it. So, hmm. A red banner. I don't know if we can find one. Hmm. <gasps> oh, there it is. Okay, 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 okay. So. Pretty much, how should we do this? I can attach... I mean, I could try to do this? Like that? Now what? Hmm. That's... Oh! 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 Gotcha! Hey, we got it! First try. Don't you dare. What is he like? Oh man. Maybe we'll, uh. Hey, how about come to the lava? How about that? How about that? How about that? I'll burn ya. <laughs> hey, that works. Jump in lava and then, like, touch a cold monster. Uh, cold snack. No, 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 no. Whoa! Boom. Yes. Gotcha. All right. Let's talk to Fluffy. Here you go. So we got a red and turn Fluffy's hand to into a red ben upper. Uh, let's do right hand. Oh, neat. Hmm. Excellent. That 
there's one more thing I must do. Hand me the Snacktivator. The old Snacktivator was worthless scrap. I have updated it. It is now capable of altering snack matter through a process of sonic anamnesis. Ugh. My body remembers what I eat. The Snacktivator can change snackified limbs into anything I've ever eaten. Use it. Change my arm from Bonapra to Strabby. Uh. Oh. Oh. So this is your diet, huh? Alright. Yum, yum, yum. Dude. Unbelievable. Oh, kind of cool, huh? Oh. Are you amazed? You've seen oh. nothing yet. If my hypothesis is correct, the bug snacks can remember the shape of my body. It is time to test that hypothesis. Use the snack activator on my missing leg. Aha! My leg is back. Done. Bug snacks can cure the sick, revitalize the frail. This discovery will reshape the world. To think Elizabeth and Agabel walked away from that. <laughs> Pathetic. <clears throat> But I refuse to dwell on personal matters while there is yet more work to do. Use the snack activator again. Transform my limbs into cocomites. <laughs> uh Okay. Don't do anything. Oh, wait, how? Well Snack. No, oh, I just was I? Uh... Use the snack activator. Okay, how? Cocomites? How? Oh. Oh, here we go. Wait, we. Wait, you don't have, you don't have a, uh, you don't have cocoa mites. <laughs> Wait, so you're telling me I have to find cocoa mites and then feed it to you? Hmm. Okay. Why is this? Oh. What the heck is this? What is that? That's definitely a co- Coco Mite Husk. It'll take a powerful force to crack this bug snack shell open. A powerful force, huh? Maybe a grapple? I'm gonna take a- Oh, here we go. Okay, so we'll just leave it there and see what he does. Four. Okay, so we have this. Yum, yum, yum. But here's the thing. It's like... Oh. oh, that worked. So, does that mean I could... Oh, all you have to do is grab one. Okay, okay. Very good. My body has changed into more cocomites than I've eaten. Nice. Can you even comprehend what has happened? This means that all bug snacks are one and the same. Each one could change into any other with the right stimulus. And now that is true of me. Now, use the snack activator to its full potential. Hmm? I want limbs of Noodler, Cocomite, Bonapper, and Stravi all at once. <laughs> a Noodler. Do we have a Noodler? Uh... Um, a noodler. All right, noodler, come on, come on, come on, come on. We don't have that much hot sauce. Nice. Okay, let's get rid of pale toss. Yes. Nice. Let's go with this. Okay, so we got the noodler. Finally, let's make a noodle leg. And then 
make a red binopper on her. I Done. have learned much. Despite your Ooh. general ignorance, you have been of use to me. Good. No matter how many bug snacks I become, my body feels no different. Is there a threshold of crumpusness? When every cell of my body is bug snacks, will I remain floofy fizzle bean? Or will I simply be bug snacks right down to the taste? I must find out. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. The answers won't come to me without further testing. However, I have exhausted my research here. I will experiment on Snacksburg. <laughs> I look forward to working with you further. Hey, I know you've been spying on me, Beth. You keep out of my business or I'll... Or you'll what? You're the one keeping secrets. You can't touch this. Nya, 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 nya. You think I'm the only one who's sick of your gossip girl stick, huh? Sooner or later, you're gonna be back in your cave all by yourself. Whatever. At least then, I wouldn't have to hear your slimy voice. Alright, what do you got? It's fine. Cromdo didn't say anything I don't already know. It's been a rough day. Why don't we, uh, unwind with some snack pods? <laughs> Find three grumpy snack pods on the beach. On the beach? Oh, uh, grumpy snack pods. Oh, there we go. Um. Oh, nice. Okay. Well, I'm not really interested in that, but, uh, let's turn in some... Stuff here. Sprinkle, let's turn in sprinkles, turn in Mount Sodi, Lieutenant Sodi, Golden Weevil, Chili Millie, uh, Studeler, mm. Cocomite, Scoopy, Pale Toss. I think that's good. Oh, hi there. Oh, ready to go exploring. Yep. According to the journal. Oh. Yep. Alrighty. Oh. D oh. Is this one of those, like, quests, like Chandler's, where we have to find, like, a big s bug snack? Lovely place, isn't it? And check out that real interesting shipwreck. If you don't mind, keep your eyes peeled for a treasure chest. Scan the treasure chest. Feed? <laughs> Didn't we just, uh... Oh man. I kinda wish I had a storage. I don't know. So the pale toss is... I believe there's a pale toss over here? Let's check. There we go. Okay, so we need this guy. You know, I just touch the fire and then touch him. Aha, sucker! That works. That's a str. Get away from me. Cool. Gotcha. Pale toss. It's not like Pokemon. Holy world. All right. Scan the treasure chest, huh? Wait, wait, what? Fruity? Oh, there's a snack pot up here. Do you think there's more snack pots? Mm, let's check this. Could be inside. No. How about outside? Nope. Wait, maybe? Nope. That settles it. This ship belonged to Grumpbeard. 
he disappeared at sea a hundred years ago. But I guess he wound up on Snack Tooth Island. Hard to tell what happened to him after that. His bones could be just about anywhere. It really is the saddest thing, isn't it? When nobody knows how your story ends. How about a pale toss? Let's give you a pale toss foot. Ooh. Ooh. Delicious. You know, Floopty's got a theory that the bigger a bug snack is, the older it must be. No telling yet how old, but imagine that snack was around in Grumpbeard's time. He could have even chased him off the beach. Fun to think about, eh? Eh? Anything else? I can't find anything. She's not here either. Um, what are you looking for? I didn't mean to keep it from you, but that journal, it, um, it belonged to my... <laughs> See, some years ago, my grandma, Veronica Ladeblog, decided she was gonna explore Snack Tooth Island and Veronica discover its history. Lada blog. We never heard from her again. Hmm. That's really why I'm out here. To find out what became of her. <sighs> Anywho, that's all for now. Let's head back to town. The running animation is so funny in this game. It's like... <laughs> Interview time. Greetings. I am not here to spew gossip for that obnoxious. I'm only after the truth. Very well. If you insist, I will educate you. Start. <laughs> I am Floofty Frizzlebean, the world's first gastroentomologist. Entomologist. In baby language, I study bug snacks and their effect on grumpuses. Okay. To study bug snacks, obviously. <sighs> when Elizabeth Megafig was recruiting for her cult of personality, I observed something strange about her arm. She was keeping it hidden, but she displayed early stages of snackification. That piqued my interest. Okay. You are asking for opinions instead of facts. I'm not going to discuss my feelings with you, you emotional parasite. Emotional parasites. Every time I try to publish my groundbreaking research, you journalists <laughs> instead churn out slander about my dangerous methods or my questionable behavior. Stop editorializing and focus on the science. <laughs> I simply wanted to continue my work, Egabel or no, but Shelda blamed me for the disappearances. I'm no stranger to witch hunts. I vacated before the pitchforks could come out. Is it true you eat grumpuses? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I've only eaten one grumpus. Would you prefer I keep my severed leg in the outhouse? The truth. <laughs> Elizabeth was an arrogant coward, unlike Egabel. Oh. Egabel truly understood my research. She was hungry to participate in it. Our work together was fruitful, even pleasant. Until somebody interfered. Shelda, that mummified fraud stoked Elizabeth's fear of my work, weaponizing her relationship to Egabel, scrambling her fragile emotions, and fabricating a binary choice between myself and Elizabeth. Ultimately, Egabel chose sentiment over science, and I surmise that was the death of her. Any final thoughts? Yes. I have the password to Agabelle's personal storage box. It may be of interest to you. Ooh. You've wasted enough of... Personal... Where's that? This? No. So... No. Probably it's upstairs. Hmm. Personal storage box. Something. Hi there. Uh, 
Hmm. Well, it's kind of out of the question, right? Let's keep going. Oh, wait. He has a quest for us. Oh, hi. What's going on? I hate to say it, but bigger snacks means more to love. Please get me the biggest snack. <laughs> Donate a praying picantus to Gramble and donate a scoopy panappy. Huh. Take care. <laughs> okay. What are you looking at? I mean Okay. Hey you pal. Let's move on with the main quest. Hi. Hey there, how's it going? What's up? Wait, whose place is this? Let's do first thing in the m at noon. All right, let's go. Wait, how about these guys? Cutscene. Where's the stump, Snorpy? I removed it with my digging device. It took five minutes. Oh, oh. bro. Thanks. Thanks. Anytime, Chandlo. <laughs> ah, chum. Good to see you on this. I've discovered something terrible. My seismic readings show that activity in the mountain is growing stronger and more frequent over time. We must find the source of the quakes before the situation grows out of control. There is an unusually large bug snack on the mountain that I'm certain is involved. Disassemble it and dispose of the components in my mouth, and once more we will have thwarted the Grumpanati. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, I... Feed one. I, mean, I did find it, like. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Delicious! Thank you, Chum, for feeding me that random bug snack. And while we're enjoying frivolous. I'm afraid that our success may provoke a counterattack from the Grumpanati. What? However, I have defenses prepared. Oh, well, almost prepared. Grumpanati. They should ward away any predator snacks looking to take action against us. Oh. I'm so glad you asked. Did you know that my trip shot can do more than, well, trip? It can also spread fires or spread waters, harness the elements of nature, if you will. With oh. that in mind, you should be able to light the rest of my flares. <laughs> oh. Get lit. Wait a minute. It can light fire. Really? What? Now you tell me? Wait. What? Am I... Oh, the trip shot. Really? Wait, what? Uh wait, what? No. Was he talking about the grappler? Or was he talking about the trip shot? The trip shot, right? I'm so confused. Uh... Yeah, that's great. Oh my god, so it's on fire now. Oh, interesting. I didn't know it worked like that. Huh. So basically I could have chip shot lava and then like throw it on a ice snack. And that would have connected. That makes sense. Okay, this is tricky, isn't it? So we have to kind of figure out, you know, what's the best way to set this up. Boom, like that. And then transfer over. Ah, cool. Okay, we got one up there. I think we're better off starting from the top and then transferring over without falling. There we go. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four. Uh, oh, bro, you're gonna burn down Snacksburg with those things. Why are you lighting off? 
It has nothing to do with Snorpy. Bro, I saw Snorpy set these 